Exploring Kuala Lumpur. Free and easy. We are around the Damasa Rally area. Driving around Kuala Lumpur City. <laughs> so we are near the Mazara Tamas area. This is an October candy shop since so now we have reached this uh, Wapika area. This is a restaurant we are going to look for our lunch. It's outside the restaurant area and this is a very colorful display panel with the toilet or washroom. The Malaysian toilet, very clean and modern. This is inside the shopping complex. It just opened, so very few people around. It's too early. Uh, this is the closer shop, the big independent closer. So we went in to have a look. It's a high class shopping. For grocery, it's well stocked and uh, a lot of display of goods. It's your fresh fruits. Good quality, but the price is a bit high. Okay, this is the area where the expatriate come here to shop. Many rich people stay around this area, Atamas area. It's an organic section where you can get all the organic food. Cool display, well stock, very fresh. And you have a guard, security guard. <laughs> That's a nice mural outside the shop, grocery shop. Please. Now we are very hungry. We are looking for a signature Vietnamese restaurant. So we we'll keep on walking and walking and walking until finally we found the shop. This shop has uh, been recommended by somebody. This is a nice Vietnamese food with a fresh Australian beef. So we came here by the Panda Shop and tried food. At last we found it. Uh, we came in, we were surprised to be met by the foreigner. It's not a Vietnamese. Is this shop authentic? We're puzzling. We went in. The shop was uh, well decorated. A lot of display of Vietnamese items and we place an order. The service was passed. That is me. Hello. Ah this is shop. Very few customers here early in the morning. We sat down, we order our food and wait for the food to come. And we saw the chef was a Malay lady, and the waiter is a, is a I think it's a Bangladesh chef or something. I was surprised. I thought I, I came to a shop where authentic food, authentic people, Vietnamese people serving. But what I found out it was the boss of the Vietnamese. Okay, food is not too bad. So I order rice. Pop chop rice and the uh, doodles. The Saint Chow Vietnamese restaurant. It's very clean. So at the corner of the shop block there, we can see the Vietnamese lantern for decoration. And we came outside. Um, the outside sitting for the smokers, and the I think they grew a lot of herbs. 
So some of the workers came out to pluck some herbs over here. The fresh herbs for the kitchen. <laughs> A nice scenery. It's outside the restaurant. Well, thank you for watching. Bye.